But we begin with new information and to a threat against Detroit police and Chief James Craig spray painted on a wall. Thanks for being with us for the news at five. That threat was found on a building along State Fair on Detroit's east side. Let's take a look. It says kill all police in white lettering and then kill James Craig in black. Jason Colthorpe is there where the graffiti was found, though, uh, Jason, it has since been painted over. Yeah, if you take a look, Devin, just so you can see the two tones of brown the owner had covered this up as soon as he could this morning. And what we're learning is this is not the first time a message almost exactly like that has gone up on this wall talking to employees here and a neighbor here. This same kind of message was up two weeks ago. I called police about that. They don't they weren't familiar with the the previous incident, but in that case it was reported and neighbors thought it was police that came out and power washed it off. It may have been city workers, but go ahead and take a look at that picture again. This is what it looked like before it was painted over. And this is the situation that uh, Chief Craig told us today that any threats against police against him is a threat against all of us. He said, is it troubling? Absolutely troubling. And they take it very serious. And he had one word to describe whoever put this up on the wall. Cowards. It's only one thing to say. Not one of them would do the job that our men and women in blue would do. We run toward gunfire, they run away. They're cowards. They hide behind in the basements of their parents' home in some instances. Uh, in this case, the person probably came out at dark and uh, did this. So we'll find them. We always do. The chief also said, you know, they need the public's help. If you know anything, if you've seen anything, please call them. And, you know, we talked about this being a disturbing trend as well. We've seen things like this specifically against Detroit cops, not even talking nationwide. Now, over the summer, there was over the Internet a threat against cops. And again, at Ca Captain Ken Stiles' funeral, another online threat. And he said this will be met the same way those were seriously with felony terrorist threat charges if and when they are caught. We're on Detroit's east side. Jason Coulthard, Local 4. Jason, I'm wondering if there's any surveillance video around, any cameras uh, around your position there. There are, you know, Devin, let me give you a look. There's one right over here on this uh, power pole over here that you can see there. But look, it's obviously pointing the wrong way. And there's another one on top of this building that's pointed kind of out of the way. You can't see that. And when I talked to an employee, he said the owner has dealt with graffiti. We even saw uh, next door they were painting. You can see the two tone on that building there. They were painting over graffiti today, too. But it has been a problem here. And they said they're adjusting those cameras to catch them the next time this does happen. Yeah, yeah. Devin. All right, Jason.